Hello friends, Krista here. Thanks for stopping by Books and Jams. Today we are going on a walking tour of little free libraries in my neighborhood. I have mapped out a four mile route in total. The farthest one out is two miles away. And we are gonna go to about six, I think, about six little free libraries. So I have on a full backpack because I have a lot of books to unhaul. Uh, some I just unhauled the other day when I was starting a new project on my shelves. Some are from my mom's house. So I have a bunch of books to get rid of. Hopefully my backpack is much lighter at the end. I'm not really looking for anything in particular. So we're gonna see what they have. Along the way, there is a cafe. I'm gonna stop and read, so I have my current read, A Girl Called Samson, in my backpack as well. I'm gonna stop and get a nice chai and sit and read for a little bit and take a little break because I'm still recovering from COVID and I don't have loads of energy, so we're not rushing through this walk today. It's just a really nice day. So I'm gonna go for a nice long walk and unhaul some books and check out the little free libraries in my neighborhood. It's been a while. Let's go. All right, here's the first one. Last time I came here, this was pretty beat up and it wasn't even, the door was off. So at least the door's been fixed. Let's see. Mostly middle grade, it looks like. I do want this book, but I don't want that copy of it. Go be pick. Fun. Okay, I had a couple classics to put in there and then this is like a student edition of the case for faith and love to pray from my mom's house added a couple lighten the load all right here's number two the farthest one away everything else is walking back home yay Lots of middle grade again. Some Allie Carter. Mostly kids stuff. I don't think I have any more kids books, but I'll add a couple adult ones in here. I did have a couple Chronicles of Narnia books, so I put those in here. And then The Helper and The Life book, which is like a Devo book devotional book and then Christ in every book of the Bible. So out of those, not taking anything. Yay. All right, here's number three. I'm a little nervous about my phone battery not lasting all the way, but I drive past this one all the time and it always looks a hot mess. So I think I might have to clean it up a bit to even see what's in here. Yikes. All right, I found these cute thank you cards. Like thank you bookmarks in here. So I put those in the front, straightened it up a little bit, and then I added the Light in Ruins, and then these like brochure kind of books from my mom's house. <laughs> and Love Comes Softly. And then I'm taking some kids' books. The Seven Silly Eaters, Construction Site on Christmas Night, and three high five magazines because my little dude loves these so yay for a couple books new to me and a cleaner little free library yay all right here is number four nothing that i need all right, so I just had lunch at Stir Crazy, which is down the road, and I have three more little free libraries to go. So I'm back at it. It's much warmer now than it was when I went in for lunch, but it was nice to have a little break because I had already walked like two and a half miles. So here we go, a few more to go, and then I'm back home. All right, number five has a cute little flower. Let's see what's in here. Fairy tale matchmaker. 
That looks cute. <laughs> Nothing that I need. This is funny though. This is what I'm listening to on audio. Now that I've charged my phone a bit more, I can continue to listen. But I don't need it. I already own it. There's a little dessert place right there. It's not open right now. So I thought I would add a little dessert book to the box. Feels appropriate. All right, two more. Here's another one. Okay, not too much in here. Do I need this? I don't think so. All right, I only feel, I feel bad because I only have a little bit left and this is the extra one that I wasn't aware of. I'm just adding one book, but hopefully someone will like it. All right, I think this is number six. Death of an air. Waiting for snow and Hannah. Okay, again, nothing that I need. Down to my second to last book, Little Beach Street Bakery. One more to go. I love this mural that's getting made. It says North Side, and some of the letters already have stuff inside of them, but the rest of them don't, so I have a feeling it's gonna continue to get done, but I really love it. And here we have the last one, it's at a church. So the book that I have is a Christian book, which will be perfect. Let's see what we've got in here. I like that this church also has a food box, like a pantry blessing box, but I don't have anything to add to that one. I have come here before with a box from my pantry, so maybe it's time to do that again fill that up a little bit. All right, I made it back home and didn't bring anything with me except those two children's books and a couple magazines. But I unhauled a bunch, walked about four and a half miles, had lunch, a delicious lavender lemonade tea drink thing that was amazing. And I stopped at a bakery to pick up this chocolate croissant, which is gonna be my afternoon snack but I'm tired and I'm desperately in need of some water. <laughs> so I'm gonna go inside, but I hope that you enjoyed that little walk around my neighborhood, kind of. I mean, I walked two miles away. That's not exactly my neighborhood, but all the little free libraries and walking distance. I was thinking there were six that I could remember, but when I checked the little free library map, there were two others that were just like a little jog off of my main route. So I'm pretty pleased with that. Unhauled a bunch of books and didn't bring any home, really. The ones that I have are not for me. So thanks for watching. That's going to be all for me today. I really appreciate you hanging out. I need to go wipe my face now. I'm very sweaty and I'm very thirsty. <laughs> so that's it. I'll talk to you in another video very soon. Bye.